Fighters from the terrorist group Hamas demonstrated how they overcame the active defense of Israel's trophy system, which is installed on Israeli Merkava Mk-4 tanks. Trophy is an active protection complex developed by Israeli companies Rafael and IAI to protect armored vehicles from enemy grenade launchers and anti-tank guided missiles, which are the main threat in the war against terrorist groups. The system is equipped with several radars and optical sensors, thanks to which it detects the shot and direction of flight of enemy projectiles. After detecting a projectile, the system automatically releases a countermunition that intercepts and destroys the projectile. Trophy has already successfully demonstrated its effectiveness in battle several times, in particular in 2011 and 2014 in the Gaza Strip. It successfully intercepted projectiles from RPG-7, RPG-29 and anti-tank systems Faggot and Cornet. Thus, Trophy is still considered a reliable means of protection against grenade launchers and anti-tank missiles. But in one recent video, Hamas fighters demonstrated a new tactic, using specialized grenade launchers with two cluster grenades similar to the Soviet PG-7VS and PG-7VR grenades. It seems that their tactics are based on identifying the weakness of the trophy system, the impossibility of intercepting two shells in a row in a limited sector. The first round from these grenade launchers is used to neutralize the trophy countermunition, after which the second round must target the tank. The second PG-7 VR grenade has significant combat power and is equipped with an advanced cumulative charge capable of penetrating dynamic defense and penetrating armor up to 650 mm. The concept of this invention of the Hamas fighters is similar to the Russian RPG-30 Kryuk anti-tank grenade launcher, which releases a simulated target and then the main 105 mm cumulative projectile. It is important to note that Hamas fighters also exploit a weakness of the trophy system, related to the unprotected blind spot above the tank, which is created by an angle of approximately 70 degrees. In practice, this allowed them to destroy one of the Merkava Mk-4M tanks with a quadcopter on October 14th. Усім дякую за перегляд. Коментуйте новини, ставте лайки, підписуйтесь на канал. Підтримуйте канал фінансово. Деталі в описі до відео. Все буде Україна.